What we're doing here today is we're test flying Teledyne FLIR's new TZ20 payload. This is unlike anything else on the market. You can zoom into targets up to 20x. When you're doing a search and rescue scenario, lives are on the line. Having the right tools and understanding how to use them is extremely important. The use case that we're uh, working on today is a simulated search and rescue. So we're in a vast wilderness area and we're trying to find somebody. Something that we'll do is we'll get up, we'll find out what area we need to search and we'll start from one end and work our way to the other end. A lot of times we're flying a, a thermal camera and we have to be low to the ground and we have to fly real slow in order to capture those anomalies. With the power of the TZ-20, you don't have to fly the aircraft to the target. You just stay where you are, zoom in. When you zoom to 10 and 20x, you can determine, is that a person that I'm looking for or is that a rock or something else that might be hot? Many times with these thermal cameras, you know, it looks like a blur on the screen. With this camera, as I was flying, it was very, very clear what I was looking at. Say, so, yeah, if that's a false positive, that's a rock, I'm gonna pull back and keep scanning and keep searching until I find my human target without having to fly all over the place. But we can fly at a higher altitude and cover more ground in a short period of time. That's important because when we're flying for a search and rescue mission, time is of the essence. And that's the power of the TZ-20 for search and rescue.